What's up guys? Coach Aramis here and today I'm going to teach you how to do a backflip. It's time to fly. That's the only thing that's on my mind. So if you want your flip to look like that, come with me. Now before we get started, there's a few things that you need to know before just sending yourself and going yeet. Because a backflip is so much more than yeet. So we're not going to be doing the yeet thing. But if you want to yell yeet while you're doing it, maybe it'll give you more power to jump up. I just realized you don't even know who I am and I'm over here trying to tell you what to do. So first things first. Hey guys, what's up? My name is Coach Aramis. I am a former level nine gymnast. I did competitive gymnastics for about 12 years and now I coach kids how to do what I used to do. If you're in the Fresno and Clovis area, be sure to come check out Flip Gymnastics. We only do private lessons here on a first come first serve basis. So if you are interested, Go ahead and comment in the comment box below, message us on Instagram, or come in and apply. Okay, I'm done talking about that. Let's get to the trick. I tell all my clients that there's three main keys that you have to focus on when it comes to a backflip. The first thing is jump. It is a straight jump before it is a yeet jump. Jump is number one. A good starting position has your core engaged, arms out in front, and you're just gonna go ahead and bend and extend. Notice how I took a slight step backwards I did not arch, I squeezed, but I threw my arms past my ears and that allowed me to go back, which is what we want in the back flip. We'll do that one again. Then extend. Step number two is the tuck, okay? We did the first part, which is a jump. Now we're gonna combine that with the tuck and see where we go. So jump and tuck, boom. I like that I'm falling backwards. This is a good sign. And number three, you better grab and pull those legs around, okay? Now we're gonna combine it all. The tuck, the jump, and the pull. So we're gonna do a flip in this one and then I'll give you guys some drills to clean it up. Ah! Now of course, if you just jump and tuck and pull, you're not necessarily gonna flip, right? So you really, really, really have to jump up so high that when you tuck and pull, your hips get above your head. Notice how I bend, I extend all the way up, then I tuck and I pull, okay? One more time. That's what I'm talking about. We stick the landings here. Woo! This video is gonna be short and sweet because I want you guys to just understand the basics of your backflip. Only try these stunts if you feel safe and ready to do so. If you are completely new to backflips and have no idea where to start, this drill is a great drill to combine all three of the things that I just told you, where you jump, you tuck, and then you pull. You're gonna go ahead, lay down flat on the ground, as if we just did the straight jump. My body is completely engaged, my chin is tucked, and my core is tight. Now, we just did the straight jump, now we're gonna tuck and pull. And you see how my hips come off the ground because I'm pulling? I can almost roll out of this, that is the goal. So squeeze, chin tucked, tuck, pull. If you guys are falling over like that, go you. One more time, jump, tuck, pull. Ah! And that's all for today's video. If you guys wanna see more content like this, you know, like common mistakes, the do's and don'ts to all these tricks, be sure to comment below. Guys, this is my new channel. If you show some love by liking and subscribing, I'll know that you wanna see more of this and I will gladly make more content like this for you guys. Other than that, I hope to see you guys soon and until next time. Yeah. These cocoa bobs go cuckoo. I ain't go to college, I got my degree from YouTube. Staying on my track, I'm letting off that choo-choo. Don't believe in choo-choo, your rappers pack